Hello everybody, my name is Palm and welcome to welcome back to my channel. So today has finally arrived. It is the final episode, well final reaction um, of The Legend of Vox Machina. We'll be reacting to episode 11 and 12. So it's the season finale and then that's it. <laughs> no more Vox Machina, we'll be done. Um, so Ah, man, that's so sad that, like, I've been really having such a fun time, like, reacting to the show. It's been so much fun, and I've had a lot of fun reading your guys' comments and learning more about this universe. So thank you guys so much for taking time to, like, write all those comments and kind of, like, explain to, like, someone who, like, like doesn't really know mu anything about the universe. Like, give me, like, information, like, tell me, like like, you know, further backstory on, like, the characters and, like, the lore and stuff. I do really appreciate all of those comments. So thank you guys so much. Also, thank you guys so much for the recent support, the subscribers, and just liking and commenting on my videos. I really do appreciate it. So thank you guys so much for coming along this journey with me. That is now finally coming to an end. Um, and I think this is Endgame. This is the big battle, right? We're finally, like, cast... As kind of predicted, like, I feel like she she definitely betrayed them. It does look like she's, like, in the control, though. Her eyes kind of, like, flickered, like, a second um, in episode 10. So it looks like she's in control, like, or she's being controlled, um, which is what I suspected, too. Like, she, like, I feel like there's no way, Cassandra, uh, not Cassandra, there's no way that Delilah would leave Cassandra's, like, a loose end to do what she wanted to really nearly without keeping tabs on her in some sort of way. So... She's definitely being controlled. We have Vax, who is also in control. So it'll be interesting. And also, they plan on using him as a sacrifice. So it's very interesting how Vox Machina is going to save them and uh, remove Vax from their control. And so I'm very intrigued because I feel like, you know, maybe... I feel like we're not, not you know, the two siblings that, are, they're, that they're trying to save, I feel like not everyone's going to come out unscathed. I feel like maybe one person... I feel like someone's... I'm gonna lose their lives here, and I'm, I, I, you know, I'm, really, I'm really scared for Vox Machina, but I am so excited to see the final battle. I'm also excited to see their motive, dude. The Briarwood's motive. I still don't know what they're doing. I we don't know like what this ritual is, what they're trying to do exactly. So, yeah, I'm excited for that. Also, I want to mention that there will be on my community tab on my channel. There will be a uh, a poll what i should react to next so if you're interested in seeing me react to more stuff you can uh vote in that poll um of what you get of what you want to see me react to next so anyways uh without further ado for the last time with legend of vox machina let's get into this video so don't not, don't mind me i will be drinking some green tea soon the celestial alignment is almost complete they need the solstice for something. I'm assuming the solstice is going to power what the ziggurat thing for them to do whatever that they're trying to do. I also like how they've been... I also do kind of like they've been keeping it like a mystery of what exactly they're trying to do to like the very end. Because it keeps you guessing. Like you're just like, okay, what is their plan? Like I still don't even like know what they're trying to do. Uh, <gasps> we should focus on this book. Oh yeah, he read the book. It wasn't a spell book, it was an instruction manual. Drawings. Oh. The symbols that all had to do with that name. The Westward one? They said he's some sort of undead creature whose soul seeks the power to return to our plane. So they're trying to resurrect some Westward one? It's the solstice. When the barrier between the planes is the thinnest. Uh, oh, sure, sure. The that's the big question though, why? Why are they trying to help the Westward now? Once he returns. You and I will be together forever. Oh. Any who would stop us shatter against what we have built. They made a deal. They really, actually, like I said, they made a deal with the devil. So, yeah, I, I feel like their little plan, even if they, you know, if they are to bring the whispered one back, I feel like that's just. I feel like I doubt he would actually even grant them the ability to live forever. Damn, dude. Love, dude. It's all for love. Don't be a fool. This fight cannot be won. Come with me. What are you doing? Percy, they'll hear. Yes. Go ahead. Shoot me. That was to be expected, to be honest. Too late. Too loud. 
don't care. Orthorax? That's the that's the that's the demon, right? Pike talked about that, that he has like some demon thing around his soul. <gasps> oh. Silas! I've been using her as a blood bag. Orthorak, interesting. Alright, look, you might as well surrender. You're outnumbered and there's nowhere to run. Guys, Lila is powerful. You already got your butts kicked by her before, so hopefully they have something up their sleeve. So that, that way it doesn't happen again. Vax, it's me! Snap out of it. Not the welcome I hoped for. Vex is gonna have to kick his butt, honestly. I don't think he's gonna snap out of it anytime soon. I've waited so long for this. You'll have to go through me. Oh no. Oh, the demon's gonna take over even still. Oh yeah, Cassandra's on his uh gun. More of your little weeds. Child's play. Kayla's gonna have to buff out, bust out some moves. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I love the music in this too. No, 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 oh. don't fade. No. Not now. Die, die, fuck Scanlan, really? <laughs> Are you ready to run? Oh. oh my gosh, she literally just muted him. Snap out of it, you fuck. It's me. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna help. I'm gonna really gonna have to knock his ass out. <gasps> Cassandra, the Rolo. Oh my God, he's gonna kill his own sister. You abandoned me, but the whispered one won't. We are his blood, and his return will herald a new. Okay, she's definitely being controlled. Like, there's no way, right? <laughs> Anyways, the music is really good. The music, I love the music. It definitely like matches, it does a really good job of matching the atmosphere. It's something that like is really hard to like ignore I guess when there's so much going on, but like music makes a show. Scanlan. <gasps> oh my gosh. Wait, that actually worked. Oh. Didn't they say something about sunlight? Get away from my gnome! <laughs> <laughs> probably a good thing I can't hear you right now. Yeah, probably. So if Pike produced enough of that powerful, like, sunlight blast, she could kill Silas. Ooh, fight it, Percy, fight it, Percy. You'll regret it. What's that? Oh, she's gonna snap out of it. <laughs> Percy was always good to her. There is work to be done. Keyleth, can you do something? Keyleth? <laughs> oh god, everyone's getting their butts kicked. Sentry. That's where all the roots are. I'm Keyleth. Of the air, Shari. Do we have time for this, Keyleth? And holy shit, do I need your help? <laughs> Ooh, let's go, Keyleth. But hurry up, please. Help me be the light. Oh, damn, that's sick. That's so cool. Yeah, salads can't stand the sun. Please don't make me do this, brother. Mm. Fuck. Vex, is that you? Oh, Vex, stop. Vex, stop. Vex, stop. Stop. Vex, stop. <laughs> oh. Don't ever do that to me again. I was ready to kill you just now. The relationship is so cute. My turn. Oh. Pike. Let's go, Pike. I'll take care of this, darling. Keyleth, 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 Keyleth. Uh, Grog's back. 
How's about you and me go for a rematch? Let's go, Grog. I believe Grog. He can do it. He can do it. Ooh. Man, it's like fencing. It's like watching him fence. Or watching someone fence. No, 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 no. No, I know what you're doing. Don't try and seduce me. I'm not trying to. <laughs> if I don't know where I'm swinging, then neither will you! Oh, that's actually smart. <gasps> <laughs> it worked! What, it actually worked? Real men hug! Get off me! Okay, Keelan, hit him! Oh my god, they work so well together as a team. Oh, wh holy. This is so sick. This looks so cool. The visuals are just absolutely 10 out of 10. Do it, kill it, do it, kill it, do it, kill it! Burn that mother effer, dude. Ooh. And just like that, they did it. That kill was mine. Oh no. Oh no. That doesn't sound good. I mean, we killed Silas, but we still have to deal with Delilah and Orthorax? You still need to go through with the ritual. What's the point now? Alice, I broke the world for us. She's got nothing to lose. That's the point. I did everything you asked. I took Whitestone. I unearthed this place. Now bring my Silas back! Her fault for listening to some demon from another dimension that you suspect is going to totally do what you say. And it's clearly more powerful than you are. What can you see? Uh, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. We gotta unlock this door. Oh my gosh, it's a door. It's another door. How long is it taking to get through this one, guys? Oh, come on. This isn't worth it, girl. Your man's is dead. He disintegrated. Flesh and all. Even the bone. This ain't worth... I'm just gonna join him in hell anyways. Well, I guess that means that it is worth... Oh, wait. Never mind. Percy, 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 Percy. Oh! Wait, they got it. Oh my gosh. They got to the door. The one time I'm actually for for Thorax is just so he can kill Delilah. I need something more. It's running out of juice. What the? No! Christ, he, he took no opportunities to shoot her in the back. Oh. Why did you do that? Pike, help me! She's still alive, but barely. I need to do this quickly before- <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
so much just happened. Um, blah, 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 blah. What the hell? <laughs> I'll accept no outcome if Keyleth dies. None. I refuse to accept any future where Keyleth dies. Not gonna happen. I will not watch. <laughs> I will stop watching right now <laughs> if Keyleth dies. Um. Huh. Wizard One is into their plane now. Um. I don't know how what that means. It's actually good though. I like that though because it does it definitely sets up for like future seasons campaigns. Like I know like there's already a past campaign that this is based on, but it definitely it does a really good job of like setting that up um, for like future uh, seasons with the Witcher because the Whispered One is in their world now. So I do like that. Delilah, she just got <laughs> Percy just. <laughs> I mean, they weren't lying about the no mercy Percy but stuff. He just basically just like, pop, pop, pop. I mean, it's not really him though. It's like Orthorax. I mean, it is him, I guess, but it's more like that demon that's taking control of him. Um, then we don't know it's Orthorax because the subtitles. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, it reminds me of, uh, oh my God, it reminds me of, uh, there's so many analogies you can make to like this exact thing. So I feel like it's like this scenario, what's happening with Percy is like, you kind of see that it's like pretty, I feel like pretty common. Um, throughout like I feel like maybe anime I see that a lot um, but uh, I guess this trope I don't know if it's called trope but you know uh, this reminds me of Black Butler very similar instance I feel like it's the same like, kind of like relationship not relationship but the same like premises as Black, at Black Butler as well too that's also a really good analogy to match it up with um, basically just like this demon that basically feeds on all of his vengeance and desires and obviously wants all his vengeance and de desires, they're all been killed, then, oop, the next one is psh, you, your life. Because I guess you're basically trading, you're trading your life for this power or whatever. Basically making a deal with the devil. Very interesting. So I'm intrigued. I wonder if we're going to, if we're going to finish that up on episode 12. Um, I guess so, right? Well, actually, no. How are we going to finish that up? Because Cassandra is on his thing. But she's being controlled though, so does she disappear? What? I wonder what happens with the list. Does the list actually go away? I don't think so. Why would the list go away? Because if you can add new names to the list, and that means the list, this Orthodox demon can be controlling him forever. Because all he needs to do is have people like betray him. And people that he, he wants to seek vengeance on. It'll just be an endless cycle. Unless he like reconciles with like everybody who's betrayed him or whatever. And he gets a bolt ahead, but technically, it lets him go on for like ever. So, interesting. They did like a little at the end of the episode, they did a little zoom in on the little orb thing. Um, I don't know what that is exactly. Maybe it's like uh, the dimension or like a portal or like an opening to where the Whisper One came from. Um, and Keyleth is on the verge of death, considering that the Whispered One saved Silas. Um, I'm assuming, and they have no pike, they have no healer, they can't, you know, I don't think any of them are, like, some A-class surgeons, so it seems like we, they might be also making a deal with the devil as well, too, to save Keyleth. It would be really interesting as well, too. <laughs> interesting. Anyways, let's continue episode 12. This is getting super spicy. Super spicy. Man, you guys were not kidding when the last episodes just go, they get, go 0-100. It's crazy. And Alexa. Try this quickly. She's been hit with like dark magic though. I don't think that's gonna work. Something's not right. The elixir? My spell? That thing must be blocking all magic. We're not done with you yet. Okay, the two siblings are just gonna torture the hell out of her, I guess. So I do think they should keep her alive. They actually she actually might be able to help. His sword. Finders keepers. Oh my gosh. Uh, I don't know if you want to keep that, Grog. We got magic. Vex, another elixir. 
Oh no no no. There's just there's no more. Oh no. <laughs> oh Forgive me. Mm. Oh no, intro. Oh my gosh, that is very foreboding. I'm so sorry. No, 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 no. But she has a bag of stuff. Disgusting mud and spit turn into some healing shit. <laughs> Come on, work. Work. They do not give an F, dude. They're literally doing their own thing. You've taken my husband and any hope of getting him back. What more could I lose? Do that to yourself, to be honest. I'll shatter your ankles for my sister Vesper. Your hands belong to Julius. Yeah, I'm about to say, he's gonna do it very slowly. Jesus Christ. <laughs> the smoke, it's even worse. Pike felt something clouding his soul. I thought she meant he was just depressed. <laughs> <laughs> That's not Percy. Caleb. It's a demon. Look. Why are you thinking better? Holy shit. How? Not just notice this? I know you're in there. Vex, please. Darling. Vex, take off Vex, the mask. Vex, 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 please. Vex, please. <laughs> oh. Oh, poor Percy. You can put it down. It, it won't let me. Oh no. Oh no, Vex, please. Oh. Don't do it! No, 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 one of them kill her instead. Because he needs to do it, right? So they just see they kill her first. Percy's screwed. Well, bye bye, Percy. <laughs> Pay attention, children. I feel like the only way for Percy to get rid of this demon is. Yes, I was going to say that. It, the only way for him, for Percy to get rid of this uh, demon is for him to forgive them. But I don't know how he's, I don't know how he's gonna do that. That's literally the only way. He has to find some way in his heart to forgive all of them. I'll kill you all! Which is easier said than done and will probably take years of therapy, so... <laughs> Oh, there's a... Mm, I don't know. So we just wait for him to kill us? Yeah, basically, I guess. We have failed our son! A family I don't know how he's gonna a legacy get lost. through this. You must avenge us. I don't know how he can fight it by himself. Fight. Yes. <laughs> oh no, Scanlan, 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 Scanlan. What are you doing to me? <laughs> Giving you what you wanted, person. Who are you? I am vengeance. <laughs> I gave you the means for revenge, and you gave me souls to feast up. It's literally Black Butler. What the heck? I was correct. It's at, it's literally Black Butler. You're not under a charm anymore, damn it! Do something against a demon. What? Yeah, reach him. Get through to him. What are you talking about, girlie? This isn't who you are! Yes, hate feels good. I've seen how easily it consumes you. It's all I have left. Oh, that's so sad. But no, it's not. Percy, you have your friends. You have your sister. You have Vox Machina. I'm the real Percy within. Find my brother. Cassandra. Exercise that demon, Percival. Oh. I don't. I actually think I. I don't know if he can. You can reach Percy. I think he's screwed. Honestly, I don't think there's any reaching that guy. Oh my God! The water is slowly crawling away. Oh no! 
Okay, but one of them actually should have just killed her. I won't let you. No. No. Oh my gosh. Man just shot his own hand. He literally just blew his hand apart. Oh, take that weapon and throw it in some lava, honestly. Throw it in the acid bath. So, that was the most fucked up thing I've ever seen. There's no way it's gone, right? Is it actually gone or what? I don't... <laughs> Even in your moment of triumph, you still managed to fall short. Oh, come on, Delilah. What else? You may have stopped me today. The Whispered One will finish what we began. Could someone just kill her, please? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Finally, about time. Oof. Look at that. Mm. Thank you. Honestly, it needed to be done. It makes sense for her to do it. Oof. Damn. Put, throw the gun in two. 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 Throw that gun in. Throw, throw it. Throw it. Throw it in there. <laughs> Regardless of its origin, it can still prove to be an effective way. Nope. Throw it away. Throw it away. And, and the whole Throw it away. I'm insane with vengeance thing. Mm -hmm. The demon is gone. No, it's Scanlon. not. The curse is lifted. No, don't be so naive, please, Percy. No. Throw it. Yeah, no. Maybe you're... Nah. No. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Scanlan. Thank you. It'll take me to make a note. <laughs> well, I'll be damned. Really? <laughs> oh. Hey, oh my gosh. Hey, no, someone commented about you know Percy. That demon was still in there. Total guess. <laughs> I don't know. People say that Percy's like a little, like, you know, like loosey goosey in the head, and they were not lying. They were not lying. He's a little loosey goosey in the head. Thank you. Thank well, thankfully, he we have a good team of friends that like kind of balance each other's stupidity out. So, I wonder if Percy's gonna stay in uh, Whitestone. Oh, what do we do? What is he gonna Just do? And smile. <gasps> Oh, Uriel, the king, they're... I forgot all about that. Scanlan Shorthalt, rebel leader. Yeah, you've probably heard of me. <laughs> anyway, I may need a bed tonight. Of course, he finds time to flirt. Oh, Mr. Giant, I see you! <laughs> Grog has a weird sense of humor. You are the true heir to Whitestone. We live as long as Whitestone lives. Help me ensure it lives forever. Now, I'm actually still intrigued. I'm sure Uriel, the charm has worn off right now that they're dead yes today oh oops okay hold up thought facts but we have responsibilities ah duty over dick i get it oh no eh. no you're right so but doesn't that's, that's not a no um it's not, it's not i don't like you that's I'm more of just like walk away okay that's so awkward oh my gosh did any of you see a woman named ripley flee from the palace tattered clothes missing hand total sociopath I'm afraid not. Oh, Ripley's still out there. Oh, hey, what about that thing at the top of the zipper twat? One of our holy men already went to investigate it. Don't touch it. Don't beat. Hopefully it's not dangerous. Uh, okay, but what Kill said, it's not a no. It's just like, you know, it's not right now. You know? Actually, I might be able to get us home a little quicker. She have the power of teleportation? Well, there's this tree spell, but well, it only works on trees I've seen before, and they have to be alive. And also, I have to be strong enough. I'm like a commercial for like a antidepressant. Like, whoa. And here's a list of 20 different side effects. So sorry, I feel like I'm saying like uh, 20 different thoughts at the same time, but like, oof, my bad if I'm like jumping from thought to thought to thought to thought, to thought too quickly. I kind of can't hold this for too long. Right, everybody in? Wait, she actually does have teleportation powers. I was just joking. What the heck? The Sovereign has summoned you to the cloud top. What, like now? Hopefully it's to reward them for their efforts of literally like saving the whole entire kingdom while they literally stayed under a spell and did absolutely nothing. I relied on my best judgment to meet these threats. But sadly, that judgment was greatly corrupted. To be fair, Uriel is actually not a bad king. He suspected, uh, he suspected the Bird was doing something, but then he got spelled, so. 
It's not really, I feel like, I don't know if there's much you can do against uh, being charmed. Any protections against being charmed. I hereby renounce the throne and cede the government to the Council of Taldori. Oh, we're coming, uh... Is it an oligopoly? And let's learn together because I am a dummy. Well, I took AP Gov. Can you believe that? Can you believe I took AP Gov? Am I dumb? No, it is not an oligarchy. Oligarchy. Oh, wait, I was right, right? Actually, it's an oligarchy. Oh my gosh. I think I was right, actually. Oligarchy are governments in which a collection of individuals rules over a nation. So, I mean, probably not the last part, but the first in oligarchy, oligarch, whatever, are governments in which a collection of individuals uh, rule over a nation. That would be what they're doing right now, because it's not a democracy, right? Because it's just a, they said they're being ruled by just the council. So that would be an oligarchy. Oligarchy, whatever. That's not a democracy. Democracy is where the people uh, choose leadership, which is not happening. It was an oligarchy. Oh my gosh, it was actually right. My AP Gov skills were actually actually used for something. I was right. They 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 turned into an oligarchy. Oligarch, whatever the heck the word is. So oh, so now Vox Machina gets to choose. Oh, that should be fun and interesting. Vox Machina is on the council. So now they get to choose and decide, like, who leads and stuff. Oh, not sorry, not decide who leads, but like what happens, what goes on in the city. Now they're leaving it to like the natural council. So now they turn from a monarchy to so a Interesting, fun. That should be a lot more fun. You know, no, we will be adding <gasps> a few more. Max. You're right. Specifically, Max? pillars of the community. Uh, does that mean dragon? Does that mean there's a dragon coming? Oh, I see. Mo oh. Oh my. Oh, oh my gosh. And that's like a red dragon? I, it was not, was that black and red dragons? This isn't like the black and red dragons like the most like, well I don't know black specifically. I saw like a black looking dragon, but I did see red dragon. And isn't the red dragon like super powerful? <laughs> Cause the last one that they fought in the beginning, wasn't that like a blue dragon? And isn't that the red dragon, the one that like killed their parents, I think, their family, whatever, killed their mother? And there are four of them? I don't know if they're all red, but they're four dragons! Four red dragons! They're more powerful than the first one! Oh my gosh. Oh, what? That's how they ended, dude? With impending doom? They're literally all about to, like, okay. Um, well... Damn, damn, dude. That's really how they end that? I mean, that was a good ending. Honestly, I just get a round of applause for this show. Um, so, one thing I want to say, though, before, like, I really touch on, like, what happened at the end of this final episode is that um, it's something, it's not hard to, like, I don't know. It's really weird though when I'm reacting to stuff. It's, I feel like it's really hard for me to like absorb the show um, just as it is um, on its own because I'm reacting to it and I am talking about each episode. But I feel like as a whole, it's kind of sometimes kind of hard to like really like absorb all of that unless I go rewatch it on my own. Um, but, um, but this show is act it's it's very very good like it is very very good it's very very like uh it's super it's top notch it is like it's amazing like i think it's like i don't know i don't think it's underrated but i think it's like super underrated in terms of like for people who just enjoy like um animated stuff this like, i feel like i'm not seeing a lot of people i mean i think a lot of people were talking about this but i feel like there should be m even more people talking about this show because honestly like as, as especially people who love on young justice who love justice league justice league unlimited like wolverine and the x-men like x-men evolution like those types of shows which i love like i feel like this is totally in that vibe and in that category of people who would who enjoy those shows would love this show like I think this is such like this has been a really amazing, amazing show. It is so good. Um I think 
Like I maybe to the Amazon Prime. A lot of people like have a lot. A lot of people have a lot of Amazon Prime, but I feel like honestly, if this show, I'm not saying Amazon Prime isn't a good, it's just like you know, a lot of people are going to see it. But honestly, though, a lot of people, I wish this show was also on Netflix as well too, because um, Netflix just reaches. Uh, you know, Netflix is definitely a lot more widely known, a lot more popular, especially to all sorts of audiences. And I feel like this show probably would have popped off like Casa Casa Casavania. Uh, I think honestly would have popped off like as much as Castlevania if it was on Netflix. Um, and I'm just saying that because it, they, like I said, Netflix, I think Netflix has a much bigger audience, much range, like they have like a lot larger, larger range of audience to reach than Amazon Prime. And I just like, honestly, the show just deserves like so much credit and it's just, it's just, it's amazing. It's, uh, it's very good. It's actually very, very good. And it's something that's kind of like easy to forget when you're reacting to it. Like I just as recognizing the show as a whole, um, how amazing the show is, how well produced the show is, how well animated the show is, like extremely how well animated the show is, especially for a first season new show like this that, you know, they did an amazing job crowdfunding. Like they did such a good job with the show. The visuals are absolutely stellar. Ten out of ten, dude. It was stellar, stellar, stellar work. And so they deserve like a claps and props for coming out of, you know, the gate, you know, running, you know. And so I, I do hope that people are able to hope, I do hope that people are able to recognize the hard work and such and the great story that they have for the show. Because I think it's like this, like they really have such a good story. Like they, ha they have such a great story just so lined out. And the you know the campaign, especially on the Unity campaign, which is you can tell is was very well structured, very well thought out, you know, and very well told. Like each person did such a good job with their character and telling the story of their character. Um, and the game master, you know, the game master did a really, really good job of like really guiding the group along and you know making a very nice and cohesive story that is you know easy to understand, easy to follow, especially if you're not in the know of this, like myself. Like I, I don't know anything about. No, a critical role and about uh, Legend of Vox Machina or any of their campaigns or anything like that. Um, but I feel like I this has been a really good introduction into that series and into the story as a whole, into that campaign, into that universe of D and D. And it's just like honestly, I feel like people are not giving them enough props for that. But yeah, anyways, I don't want to talk in circles, but I just want to like honestly give my props, give my thanks to everybody that's involved in making such an amazing and creative show. Like, ugh, it's just so good. I think I need to go back and watch it on my own, though, to really like feel it. Because it's, it's so different. Like, I don't know. I don't really know how to explain it, but it's like it's reacting to something and watching it on your own. As long as say for me, it's like it's very different. Like, uh, it's just very different feelings, maybe because I, I don't know. Like, like I said, I still had fun. Like, I very much had a fun time watching Vox Machina, I, I enjoyed it, but it is a little different when I have like bright lights at the camera and the microphone and I, I know I'm talking through my thoughts and just sitting there, just sitting watching, just absorbing it, you know? I don't know. But, um, ah, oh gosh, I can't believe that's it. It's ended, it ended with such craziness, such a banger. The ending was just so crazy and, and a great to the season two, which I'm really excited for ending um they're in like an all garp all garp whatever you know what i'm saying Vox machina now is part of the council which is ruling the whole entire nation but now they are done <laughs> it's very interesting it's very funny how you're gonna step down from his power once uh, a horde of four uh red dragons came flying in to kill them all very interesting he's just like oh well it looks like he picked the perfect time to just say peace to this a country that's about to get wiped uh, by these dragons, so it's very interesting how they're going to handle that. Um, it's very interesting to see how their power is going. I'm very interested to see if their power will grow even more. They get more used to themselves and their power, especially with Keyleth. I'm very interested to see how Keyleth is going to grow as well and get into her power. I'm very interested to see how the relationships will form, if there will be any new like romances or or anything like that. Um, so I feel like that's kind of like a little like it's kind of like an extra. Like I feel like the romance part is very much like an extra little little thing you know like a little like treat i'm not really like too interested in the romance in the romances um i really like the characters on their own um and that's together too um because they just their, their relationship is so amazing i just love their relationship it's so cute it's so fun 
and they just have like a really very good cute bond and their bond is just getting stronger and stronger as they go through all these battles so it's great to see um yeah but I, I anyways um i've had so much fun um reacting to this i hope you guys enjoy these reactions too let me know your final thoughts in the comments section down below and thank you guys so much for coming on the stream with me i really appreciate it again i have a poll on my community tab on my channel of uh the um of uh, what i'm going to be reacting to next uh i have some like four choices so you guys can go and check that out and pick what i should react to next um after legend of vox machina and yeah thank you guys so much for the recent subscribers the subs well, that's the same thing <laughs> and you guys for the recent support the likes comments uh, subs, everything like every comment uh, means a lot every comment helps um, and every like helps too as well and I just love reading your comments too I love learning more about the show the lore and everything because it's been a really fun ride and I've had a lot of fun reacting to this so thank you guys a lot um, and follow me on social to see more of my face like and subscribe and turn on post notifications you know for I upload a new video and that is going to be it for the Legend of Vox Machina and I'll see you next time <laughs> bye